hi everyone welcome to my channel thank you everyone for liking and subscribing and hi to all my new subscribers welcome everyone um i've got the gilded tarot on the table and i'm going to read about the british royal family i haven't read for them as a whole for a while uh but i did see a sorry about that I did see a um, an announcement come through about uh, Beatrice uh, expecting baby number two. Uh, then they mentioned Kate. Oh no, it's Princess Catherine. They use that for clip bait. I swear. Um, is on the men. Well, there's still tests, but yeah, so far so good, right? And um, then you know they said, well, Harry's back. Well, you know, at the time that they they wrote that, sure, but you know, we'll, we'll just who cares where he is now anyway. Um, what they did refer to as as this year being, you know, like our late Queen's one in the 90s, early 90s, where it was the Anus Horribus, Horribus I think you pronounce it. Um, yeah, is it finally over? So that's basically the question to these cards. I um, don't want to know about any privacy. Um, I'm not going to breach any privacy uh, with King... Or Princess Catherine, I just want to know uh, cards, please. Yeah, how they going? I mean, you know, there's only a couple of months left of this year, right? <laughs> so, how's our British royal family going? Okay, Ace of Swords, Reverse, Temperance, Ace of Cups. King of Cups, Ten of Swords, Reverse. Oh, dear. Okay, well, there's a lot of BS out there that for some unknown reason, because you've got the Ace of Swords here, um, there's, there's some sort of thing that the British royal family is on, right? I, 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 I don't know where it's coming from. I would think we can all guess where it's coming from anti royalists and possibly melodrama Cito. Um I can't see how that would be the case. Uh, you do have temperance here where uh, you've got healing and blending and mixing and, and here's here's the king now. Here's Charles, the King of Cups. And um, this is my Earth Shot card. You've got the Ace of Cups. But it's offering love. It's um, you know, uh, looking into it, um, you can see that there's hope, isn't there? You know, um, I'll just keep going and mixing and healing. This is healing, so that's a good thing, right? You got the King of Swords, Queen of Cups Reverse, and the Hierophant. Well, as we as we go at the moment, Charles is still going to be king, right? Um, the firm themselves are worried that something's going to be ruined. Um, I'm not too sure why, but they're sort of like that way. Looking at the, the Ten of Swords reverse, I think the firm's worried about what might be said about the King of Cups. Sorry about that. Um, you've also got... The King of Swords on top of the, on top of Temperance, and when you've got the Reverse Queen of Cups. Oh dear, that's that's not a good sign. That's not a good sign, is it? I wonder if Camilla's okay. I wonder if Camilla's okay. I mean, neither Camilla or Charles are spring chickens, right? I wonder if Camilla's okay. Hmm. All right, let's just keep going. Uh, King of Swords, of course, is um, William still doing his healing. He's still doing the blending and the mixing, uh, which is a good thing. Um, we've also got the Queen of Pentacles here now coming over. William's actually worried about his stepmother as well as Catherine still. I think he'd like a new beginning. I think he understands there's a new beginning uh, that is happening. But I'm not too sure exactly why 
both queens of reverse. Um, I think he's extremely worried about both of them. Where the king's upright. I think he's he's he probably knows he's got to look after both of them. While the king is attending to you know the formal things, he's got a lot on his plate. You've got the nine of pentacles here as well. A six of cups, nine of swords reverse. Well, nothing's been passed down from the siblings, is it? So I could probably call the Knight of Pentacles as Harry as much as I don't want to bring him into this reading. We do have Harry on that, you know, uh, notice that I thought, yeah, let's let's find out how, you know, how, how the British royal family is going. Nothing to do with Harry at all, but... He is on that reading, on that uh, report. And he will always be a part of William because it is his brother. As much as we don't want it to read on him every day, um, if we're reading about the royals, especially William, you know, there's a chance that it will probably come through. Uh, I think he's worried um, what is going to happen, but he's definitely um, distanced himself from his brother uh, and nothing, you know, it doesn't exist. It doesn't exist. And Williams, he's not even looking at him, you know. And and even even the Knight of Pentacles, they're looking at, at certain directions. I mean, yeah, so there's no need to pursue that. I think Williams' main, main worry at the moment is the effect that um, it's having on uh, not only his um, stepmother but, also Princess Catherine here, and or the late Queen. Because the late Queen, um, when I used to do readings on her previously, she would always pop up as the, the Queen of Pentacles. And if that's the case, then we could also cross-refer being reversed as the people pass as the mother as well. So, you know, that's probably a nicer reading, Um I will pull more cards to verify it, but you do have a chance here that he is just trying to make the monarchy as nice as it can, honouring his mother as well as the late queen. And that probably makes more sense, despite the fact, of course, he is going to be worried about Camilla and he will be worried 100% about Princess Catherine. I would definitely say that we've got both options here until I pull, pull more cards. The fact that the brother has come through, they're not looking at each other. There's no connection here with the Six of Cups, none whatsoever. They're, they're you know, across the bond, literally. Um, I think Charles... Harry has come through on Charles' side of the reading and um, that's probably where we're going with the Bruin side where, you know, Charles and the firm and the monarchy and the grey coats or whatever are dealing with that. There's no more anxiety. None. They've dealt with it. The two of pentacles they're juggling. The six of swords. They're in karma waters at the moment so that's good right that's good you got the page of swords and the eight of swords and the three of cups so yeah i think i think they're playing nicely together i think we're talking about three people here obviously william uh charles and the monarchy and the firm themselves like the whole the whole kitten kadoodle we are reading about the british royal family and the monarchy and how they're going uh they are definitely um playing nicely together um well that, that's indicating a party but i don't think they're partying too well although maybe they're looking forward to the christmas scene because you know everything sort of like went pear-shaped after that last year um we do also have the eight of swords here they are bound um, they are bound by certain words, they are bound by certain messages, um, they are still juggling here, they are still juggling and they, meaning the whole monarchy kind of thing because it's a general reading, um, they are going into karma waters, there will be a message out but they are still bound, they are still bound to, you know, saying certain things with words, um, they're not playing... I don't get the victim card here. Um, I don't. 
I definitely don't get the victim card, so I'm not even going to pursue that. Uh, that's just um, binding, mentally binding yourself kind of thing. Eight of Cups, Reverse, Ace of Swords, Five of Wands. Eight of Pentacles and the Four of Swords reverse. Hmm. Okay. Well. Hmm. I think they're dealing with one thing at a time. Um. Dealing with it very, very slowly. Uh, as at the moment they are stuck where they are. As much as they they are moving into calmer waters, they they can't deal with certain things. Uh, or they are working hard at it with what will come eventually, playing nice. <laughs> um, I think they're working at it. I mean, I, yeah, the, everyone has a funeral plan, right? Um, this is not the funeral plan here, but it is insinuating, you know, when the time comes. Um, there's, there's no fights in-house. No fights, no squabbles, no arguments. They're just getting on with it. They're just getting doing what they do best. They're just getting on with that. They're working hard at what they're doing. Um, you know, there, there's no what they're saying here. What the cards are saying is that there, there's no shiny bright thing. There's no well, it's time to party and and you know, um, it's all good from here onwards. It, no, no, the cards are saying that. That's your report. That's your reporter. How the how's the royal family doing now? They're healing. They're doing what they do best. Charles is allegedly entertainment purposes only. He's looking after the darling boy, or or is attending to all the issues that you know, trying to ruin the monarchy. Allegedly entertainment purposes only. William, I would say, is just. Is trying to to start a new beginning to honour his mother and his late grandmother and care and look after his stepmother and his wife. And it's pretty simple. They're juggling, but they're healing. Uh, they are worried about the BS that the Knight of Pentacles is bringing out, but like I said, that's on Charles' side anyway. Uh, their hands are tied and, you know, they're just, yeah, they're dealing with one thing at a time. Well, that's what they need to do. I think they're probably finding it a little bit hard, especially with it being the reverse. But also reverse four swords is not a good thing, but, you know, we'll just leave it at that for now. Uh, the fact that the King of Cups is upright is a good thing for now. Oh, I hope. Well, it was nice to catch up just generally read how they are, how they're going, because they definitely just get on with business, don't they? Please like, share and subscribe, and I'll see you again soon. Bye.